How's it going guys? Uh, this is going to be part 14 of my record collection. Um, yeah, thanks for everybody who actually watches my videos. Um, I know they're not the most interesting things, but uh, I just like to relate to people who collect records and, uh, and that's pretty much why I started this channel in the first place. Um, just to share music with other people and whatnot. But um, anyway, uh, first record. Um, obituary, Cause of Death, uh, Roadrunner, Reissue, Preston, uh, not sure exact, the exact year, but it's pretty recent, the pressing. Um, but yeah, my uh, all-time favorite death metal album, I don't really think it needs an introduction, freaking classic record here. Um, James Murphy on guitar, just... Uh, Kills the solos, but uh, got the uh, printed inner sleeves, and like the uh, like all obituary releases, no lyrics. So yeah, it's on black vinyl, but it does have a cool picture label though. Actually, so you can get a close up of that. So yeah, like I said, if I had to choose, um, this would probably be. Uh, my all-time favorite death metal album. It's just classic old-school death metal at its finest. And also I think it's their best release too. And it's the best artwork that they've done, or that they've had. Um, next up, another one of my favorite bands uh, since I was a kid actually. Um, this is The Offspring with Ignition. Uh, this is their second, uh, second full-length album that came out in, I want to say, 92. Um, this is a uh, reissue as well. It came out, I think, last year. Um, I got the uh, Hot Topic variant of the uh, Clear Orange. Really awesome color. And the uh, printed inner sleeves, which is pretty nice. So yeah, um, one of my favorite Offspring albums for sure. Um, I really prefer their early stuff anyways, but yeah, this is just a, a really good punk album. Um, if you haven't heard this one in particular, the songs uh, Session, um, Kick Him When He's Down, and uh, Dirty Magic, those are probably some of my favorite songs off the album. So yeah, check this one out if you haven't. If you like the Offspring. Uh, next up, I've got another one by the Offspring. This this is like their uh, breakthrough album, Smash. Came out in '94, uh, and uh, this one's definitely my, my favorite Offspring album. Um, Another recent reissue comes with some nice uh, printed inner sleeves. And uh, just black vinyl for this one too. But I'll show the picture labels real quick. Pretty nice. But yeah, obviously, this is a classic album. Um, somebody hasn't really listened to The Offspring, maybe they only know their radio songs, which are their worst ones usually, um, then you need to check out this album because it's their best one in my opinion. Um, next up I've got one more by The Offspring. Uh, this is the follow up to Smash. This is Ixnay on the Ombre. Uh, this one came out in 97 I think. But um, yeah, another really good, good album by The Offspring. This one uh, just comes on black vinyl as well. And lyric sheet. And some weird picture on the other side. I don't even know what that is. But anyways. Um, yeah, I love The Offspring. Um, takes me back to when I was younger. Alright, 
so moving on. Um, one of my favorite albums of all time right here. Uh, this is Opeth with My Arms Your Hearse. And uh, it's definitely my favorite Opeth album. Uh, this one came out in 1998. Got this nice uh, gatefold reissue here. Double LP. Comes on some heavy one uh, heavy black vinyl here. But yeah, this this Opeth album to me is very special. Um, I just I love the whole concept of the album. I just like how it flows together. Um, this is one album you can't really listen to just one song. You gotta, you gotta listen to it from beginning to end because. Um, yeah, it's, it's just a, a really good atmospheric album. Uh, for you, the, uh, for those of you not familiar with Opeth, maybe especially this album, they're a progressive death metal band, and uh, I think this album is more on the raw side compared to their later albums, but um, in my opinion, it's, it's their best. But um, that's just my opinion. Um, so check this one out if you haven't. Um, next up, it's going to be the last record for this video. Um, I've got Blackwater Park by Opeth again. Another reissue that came out recently, maybe a few years ago. Um, yeah, this is considered their best by a lot of Opeth fans, probably most of their fans. And um, it's hard to argue with that, you know, it's definitely one of my favorites. It's probably my second favorite Opeth album, it's, but it's pretty hard to rank them because I like Opeth so much. Um, comes with some nice uh, cardboard inner sleeves. And this is like all the kind of revamped artwork that they did for the album. It's very similar to the original, but I think it looks better. Um, I also like this because it comes with one of those uh, full booklets, full-size booklets. It's pretty awesome. There's some like really creepy artwork in there. So yeah, I mean, if you haven't heard this album, you definitely need to check it out. So it's a classic and death metal. And uh, the reason I like Opeth so much is because they're more than just a death metal band. Um, comes on black vinyl, very nice. And the uh, second printed inner sleeve. So yeah, I don't know what else to say about this album besides that it's freaking awesome. If you haven't heard it, go listen to it because you're missing out. But um, yeah, anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. Um, thank you for everybody who watches my videos and actually uh, subscribe to my channel. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to make another one tonight, so uh, thanks for watching.